In this video, we're going to introduce the R package Shiny for easily creating interactive web pages from R. You'll see how you can use R to produce interactive graphs in a web page, which can then be used with any browser, making it easy to share even with people who are not familiar with R. The overhead of turning static graphs into interactive graphs is negligible considering what you get in return. Before we dive into the details of Shiny, let's run an example. First, we need to install Shiny. Open R and run the command install packages Shiny or use the install package button in the package panel. You only need to do this once. Next, let's run an example. Open activity 0601 and load the package and run the Shiny command. By running the example, we have created a small local web server which hosts our interactive web page. A web browser opened with an interactive histogram. The graph changes as you move the numbers of samples on the slider from 1 to 1000. On top of the interactivity, which we didn't have before, the advantage of a web page is that anyone with access to this page can use it, even if they don't have R installed on their machine. To stop the server, go back to RStudio and stop the command by using the stop button. In this video, we have installed the R package Shiny and saw it generating a web page with an interactive graph written in pure R. In the next video, we learn the structure of a Shiny app.